channel. Today I'm going to be doing a video on a pet sling. Now I bought this pet sling for an upcoming trip that I have planned um, next month to go to Boston. I am going to see a friend of mine, um, or a couple of friends of mine actually, and we are going to see Adele. Woo! I'm so, so, so excited about that. And I'm excited to bring Stassi on her very first airplane trip. So I will be staying at my friend's house. So it was the perfect opportunity for not leaving my baby at home. And so Stassi is coming with me. So I, you know, I was trying to figure out how I'm gonna do this because I've never flown with her before. And she does not like to walk on a leash, like at all. So I had nightmares of thinking like, oh my goodness, I'm gonna put her on a leash and she's just gonna like plop down in the middle of the airport and I'm not gonna be able to get her to move and everybody is gonna be staring and I have to figure something out. So I, you know, I have her Sherpa bag and so I am bringing that. However, you know, she weighs 10 pounds and it's not a whole lot, but when you put that on your shoulder and, you know, lug it through multiple airports throughout the day because I don't have a direct flight because those don't freaking exist anymore. Um, so I figured, no, I need something that I can carry her because just holding her would get tiresome as well. So I started my hunt for the perfect pet sling. And there are many, many different brands and makes and styles on the market. And so I bought one that I think is going to work. I hope it's going to work anyway. And so I wanted to show you guys what I got in case you are in the market to have a pet sling as well. All right, so let's see. Okay, so the one that I decided on is a pet sling by a company called Pet Flies. And this is what the sling looks like. Now it has a long strap and this is used for crossbody. So that's what I was looking for. I was looking for something that I can use crossbody because that way she would be like right next to my body and anything crossbody is always much easier to carry because your weight it like evenly distributes the weight from you know to your whole body so this one can be adjusted and it has this really pretty um kind of buckle on the edge here it's made out of like a silver um it actually feels like plastic, but it's like silver coated. And this is what you use to adjust the straps with. Now it did come with a big flower right here, but I took the flower off and I didn't think to save it to show you guys, sorry, but I thought it was really ugly. So I just threw it away because <laughs> that's what I do. Um, but I love the bag and it's so pretty and it's in kind of like a tapestry print. So I'll hold it up again so you can see. It's in shades of like um, tans and browns and it looks like a little bit of like that Tiffany blue color is in here. And then the stitching is done in a real pretty like khaki color. So I thought that this one, you know, looked really good as far as support wise. It doesn't have a whole, you know, it doesn't have any support in the bottom. So the bottom is soft as well, but you know, it fits her perfectly and she fits in it perfectly. And it fits me good too. I will pop in some pictures towards the end of the video with me wearing her in it. And she just kind of sank right down into it when I put her in it. Cause I wanted to, you know, make sure that she fit in it. And she does. Um, like I said, she is 10 pounds. So I think for any dog up to probably, um, I think they say up to 16 pounds for this one will fit in this Pet Flies pet sling. Let me show you a couple of more features. So in the front here, we have a pocket. It's not a very deep pocket, so it's just like a little shallow pocket. I'm gonna put her down. 
And then on the sides, we have like a water bottle, an area to put a water bottle. And then this is just a little tie that you can untie and then tighten it to make it, um, you know, go around your water bottle if you need to. And then on this side, we have the same thing. So you have places to put two water bottles in the, um, on the sides. And then on this end of the carrier, you have your leash, I mean your collar strap. Now this is really important. Stasi doesn't wear a collar, but I will put her harness on her and I'll clip her harness to this little chain while she is in the bag just for extra safety in case she decides to like leap out or something. At least she'll be attached to this little chain. The harnesses that I use are by the Well Lived Pet and this is what they look like. I love these harnesses. I have done a video on them, so if you're interested, you can go to the playlist under, I believe, favorite products and see a review on these harnesses. But I'm going to use one of the softest ones that I own from the Well Live Pet, which is like this one. It's so soft. I mean, literally you can do this with it. So it won't aggravate her when she is in the bag. It's nice and loose. Um, and she will be able to be clipped, you know, right on the D-ring of her harness while she is in the bag. So I think that's going to work out good. Now, I forgot to show you the inside of the bag. So the inside of the bag is a giraffe print, and I didn't even know this when I bought this. Um, so I was so excited to see the coordinating giraffe print in the inside because I love anything animal printed. It would have been better if the giraffe print would have been on the outside, but that's okay. We have it on the inside and I think that it's really, really cute. Um, and let's see what else I can tell you about the bag. Really is nothing much else to tell you about the bag. It seems to be very well constructed. The stitching seems very nice and it looks like it's going to hold up, you know, pretty well. So I'm really excited to try this out. She is going to be in her Sherpa bag um, in the plane, I'm pretty sure. Um, I'm working on something right now for, um, a way for me to carry her on my lap in the plane. Um, so I will let you guys know that if that works out, um, you will see it because I'm going to be vlogging the trip. So um, hopefully that's gonna work out in time for when we have to leave. But I am, you know, if not, I will have her Sherpa bag with me so that she can, even if she does sit on my lap in the plane, we'll have the Sherpa bag with us as well because sometimes she does get tired of being held. I think she gets hot. Um, and so I can put her in the bag and then, you know, switch her up. But the main reason I wanted this was to be uh, able to carry her through the airport without having to carry her on my shoulder in that bag. These are also really good if you take if you take your dogs anywhere. Um, if you take them on the weekends to like an art fair or a craft fair or anywhere else that you take your dogs that you want to carry them, these slings really really do a great job. Now, the bag also came with a little surprise in the inside, so I wanted to show you guys what that is. And it is two precious little toys, and I'm so glad that they are pink toys. So look how cute this is. These are little owls. So the first one has like a little hole in the inside, and a sneaker, Sassy. You can tell what kind of toys she likes the most. <laughs> okay. She, she decided she wanted the toy. <laughs> she loves toys, especially soft ones with squeakers. Those are her favorites. <laughs> and I think she loves that. So you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna pick these up and I'm not gonna give them to her until we are on the trip so that it's something new, so you can't have it. Okay. <laughs> it's for a good reason. It's for a very good reason, I promise. Okay, the next toy that they had in the little bag is just a fat little owl. 
And he also has a squeaker. <laughs> You're gonna steal this one too? We gotta save it. We gotta save it. We're gonna save it for the trip. Huh, it's like a child, you know, really. She is like a child. Look, she's grabbing the, she's grabbing it from me. Okay, we're gonna save it, okay? We're gonna save it, that way you'll have a nice new toy for the trip. Okay, I think she understands. <laughs> Don't look at me with those sad eyes. You love this, huh? I love it too, I think it's so cute. Oh yes, 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 yes. <laughs> She's so damn cute, I swear. And so sweet. Yes, she is. Okay, so I think that's pretty much all I can tell you about the bag. Um, I love it. I'm going to show you some pictures in a little bit. Hopefully it works out. I will vlog the trip, and I'm also planning on doing a packing for dogs when you're taking a dog on an airplane video. So stay tuned for that. And then, of course, after we get back, um, I will show you the... Um, vlog of the trip that we that we are taking huh and too bad she can't come see Adele because we love to sing some Adele huh but she has to stay at my friend's house while we go to the concert oh well all right so that concludes this video guys I hope you guys enjoyed if you have any questions or comments please leave them in the comment section below I will leave the link to where I got this bag in the description box below in case you are interested and that's it so we will catch you on the next video ah! we will catch you on the next video we hope you guys have a great day bye guys say bye Stassi say bye everybody say my mom is mean and won't let me have my toy bye guys We're gonna keep these in the bag so that you can have a fresh new toy, okay? Okay? Sounds good? Sounds good? Huh? Sounds good to you? Hello, it's me. <laughs> Send my love to your new lover. Treat her better. Gotta let go of all of our love. We both know we ain't kids no more. Send my love to your new lover. Treat her better. Gotta let go of all of our love. We both know we ain't kids no more. We ain't kids no more. They say the time's supposed to heal ya, but I ain't done much healing. We ain't kids no more